man working on this steel fs 110 i am what i'm doing right now is i'm applying a gasket sealer to the flat surfaces i use this little tool right here to do that uh you just need a very thin coating it doesn't have to be real thick i do it real carefully you don't want to get it down into the chassis i've also got this this is a four cycle hybrid so you got to have it on zero i can recheck it again after i get the um bottom piece on get it down in there because i want to get a good seal on this so this is what i used to do it um i will press the lower shell casing on to see what kind of footprint i got make sure i got none of the excess of this rtv going down into it which I shouldn't. If I get a little bit in the bolt hole, that won't hurt. Actually, so I'll make sure I got no. Just a nice thin coat. I like this RTV. This is what I use. It's uh, rated for high temp. So I got it slightly painted, nice and neat. Not real thick. I don't like it real thick. Make sure cover goes on. And here we go. And that goes on this side. Goes on the flywheel side, can't miss it. I'll press it down. Got a little bit of transfer. Looks like I'm gonna be really good. I got holding it in my vise trying to do this. Here we go. Yeah, we're gonna have a good transfer. I don't have it on too thick. Okay, now I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna make sure you got all the right screws, starting with your fingers. These are easy to cross thread. Remember, everything's aluminum, so. You'll cross, this, you'll cross thread these like it's nothing. So you gotta make sure you got them started. One or two threads. And they got they got a locked on collar on it. And then you can look up the torque spec and come back and torque them. And I'm just gonna pull them down somewhat tight. Give it a little bit a little bump. I know I can't go too bad with it. Just a little bump right now, so I get them down in. And that's it. And then I'll recheck them and torque them. Okay, that should pull the clamshell together. I should see if I get a good seat on it. I'll take them back out real quick. I just want to make sure I got a good... This is how I do it. I don't... How you do it is different. Pull them back out real quick. I'm just looking for clamshell. Ah, I got a nice compression on the on the RTV, so I'm happy with that. I didn't see any went down in there. Not any boiling out. I got a good compression, good seal all the way around. I'll lock these back down. So I check it, make sure I didn't one put too much or too little. But my little technique with my tool has worked out pretty good. I've had really good luck with it over the years doing it with it so I've done quite a few of these one little bump I'll check the torque that's good and then I'll recheck it and torque it okay I'm happy with that so that's the clamshell on with the crank installed so we're a good start got a good seal I'm very confident that gasket has done its business in my sailing, done its job. All right, that's Henry the Wienerman FS110R putting the clamshell on and checking the gasket material, making sure I get a good seal. Henry out.